Let's talk bedside crib safety. Now, the most important thing that you need to check when you're buying a bedside crib is that it conforms to the latest safety standard, which is BSEN 1130 2019. Now, one of the major stipulations of this standard is that the inside wall of the bedside crib must have a minimum height of 12 centimetres when in bedside mode. Make sure you read the instruction manual when you're assembling your bedside crib and if you want to use it in bedside mode with the side down, you must secure it with the straps provided to the adult frame of the bed. It's important when in bedside mode that the internal wall height is no higher than the height of your mattress. Now a lot of the bedside cribs have ratchets so you can adjust their height to make sure that they're at a safe level. Now we're going to attach the bedside crib securely to the adult bed frame using the straps. So now the crib's attached to the bed, it's really important to double check there isn't a gap here between the internal wall and the mattress, because if there is, you're not going to be able to use the bedside crib in bedside mode. Now, don't be tempted to pad out this gap with duvets, blankets or pillows, because these can pose a suffocation hazard for your baby. Now, if you're worrying about the duvet moving into the child's sleep space during the night, we would suggest positioning your duvet further away from the edge where the crib is attached. Now, for extra peace of mind, you could always try popping the side back up on the crib after every time you've attended to your child, and a lot of manufacturers suggest doing this anyway. Check the tightness of the straps before each use by gently pulling your crib away from the side of the bed to make sure it's still secure. Now, it's also really important to remember that as soon as your child can either sit up, pull themselves up, or raise themselves up onto their hands and knees, you must stop using a bedside crib and transition to a cot. Finally, never use the bedside crib with the side down if it's not securely attached to the adult bed frame.